Hey everybody, you asked for it. Here it is, my face. <laughs> okay, if you have zero idea what I'm talking about, I'll tell you in a second. But hello everybody, it is I, Margaret, your friendly neighborhood Texas gal, Treasures. And I am here with a jewelry bag unboxing. And I titled this, what did I title it? Bag of Garbage or Treasure Galore. I'm hoping for treasures galore, but I don't know. <laughs> so we'll just leave it a big question mark there. Um, and before we get started, I wanna say hi and I wanna say thank you everybody for being a pair of ears for me over the last few days uh, because I have been in a really rough place with all the move. And of course, who comes now? I've been in here setting it up. But who decides that she wants to come and play with the cord? Mimi. Bye, Mimi. I love you, sweetie. Mimi's my girl, so don't, don't fuss at me for spraying her. She knows it. She'll be back. Um, so yeah, uh, I've been in a kind of a really big funk because of the move. I've been trying to pack for like two months now. And yeah, so yesterday I kind of fell apart a little bit and uh, you guys were there for me. So if ever I w felt bad about saying that you guys are my tribe, I no longer have any qualms about that because you guys have been this giant safety net for me and have given me such amazing support and just great advice. I mean, yeah, there were a few advice that I was just like, wait a minute, that's not right. Even I was like, that's not right. Um, but yeah, such good perspective that I just want to thank you. And yeah, so thank you for being my tribe, you guys, and and boosting me up. Um, I yeah, some of the ridiculousness of of what I was saying yesterday with um like my mom has been offering to help me, and I'm like, no, 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 no. And you guys are like, what are you doing? You're like killing yourself, and people are trying to help you, and you're not letting them help you. I'm like, you know what? You're right. So I am taking my mom's advice, or your advice, I'm taking my mom's help. I am, I just said stop. We didn't, we went today to the aquarium, to the rainforest, we went and had a good time. Um, I stayed up last night because I knew I wanted to get out. So I recorded that video, I put it out this morning, the, the other jewelry bag that I opened, recorded the video yesterday afternoon, and I stayed up till midnight editing it. So, uh, also because a lot of people are like, oh, I wish that you would put the videos out. I don't, I don't want to use a mean voice because it's not really mean, but they like to see it up close for different reasons. So I was like, okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to make this video. I'm going to stay up. I'll edit it. I'll have it ready for tomorrow for, for Monday. Um, and then I'm just going to call it a day and go, go to the rainforest, go to the aquarium. And then, and then I asked everybody, Hey guys, what do you think about this format? And most everybody was just like, no, <laughs> but not in a mean way, you know, it was just like, no, like Margaret, we're the tribe. Like this is our tribe. We're here to, we're here to tribe, to jibe, to, you know, to flow. Okay. We really are here for a jewelry unboxing. So if you're new here and you're like, when is this woman going to get to it? Eventually. Um, so I just had to say that because it really meant a lot to me. And at first I was like, Oh, they didn't like my video, but then it was like, no, they were saying really nice things about us, you know, us as a, as a fam, as a family, I hate to use a family word because I know other resellers have their reseller family, but, um, yeah, the Texas gal try. Woo. Okay. I'm going to go, let's not chase pancake right now. Okay. 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 <laughs> um, what was I gonna say? I forgot. <laughs> of course, cat chasing goes through. Uh, what was I saying? You guys, what was I saying? Okay, I'm gonna say hey in the chat. Um, uh, hey Debbie, I send to you guys. Hi Connie, oh thanks. Uh, yeah, I, I'm enjoying it too, I'm enjoying playing with it. I'm playing in the mirror a lot more than I like, that sounded weird. I don't know. Anyway, um, <laughs> hey Mary, Nini, hey Connie, hi River City, hi Debbie. How's it going? Um, oh, you love those. Okay. Oh, and then also, so I got some really good. I don't know if uh, Murphy the Esky's in the chat or if she will be in a little bit. Shannon, Sharon, Sharon. 
I, I hate saying real names because I always get it wrong. But she and I were like on the same wavelength today because I was thinking as we were driving home from Galveston, um, some people like to see the face and like to see it like so, like the bag and all that. And I was thinking on the way home, like what would it be to, okay, to use the vernacular of the kids today, would it be too extra for me to like put out a second video sharing the pieces that I'm planning on selling and showing them up close? I'm going to use a Valley Girl voice because I don't know why. Um, but um, to create like a supplemental video to go with the live unboxing, um, to sh have the camera facing down just on the pieces that I want to sell, um, showing the showing them up close and maybe at that in that video putting like keywords titles that i might use um and the actual price that i think i'm going to sell it for because when we do the videos like this live i haven't done any research obviously because it's an unboxing um <clears throat> but that way if you're interested in like well i want to know how much that would actually sell for or what are the keywords how would you even write a title for that um so i'm thinking that that's what i'm going to do we'll, we'll try it out and see how it goes because it does take time to edit and all that good stuff but you know what I mean the whole point is that we're learning together and that the video yesterday some of the things that I was like oh maybe 10 or 15 bucks I looked it up and it was like $45 $65 like wow okay never mind that was awesome so we'll see how it goes um, Murphy the S kid sent a mess or made a comment like why don't you do this he's like oh my gosh I was just thinking about that on the drive home but I thought people would think, really? We gotta watch this again? Well, you know what? You don't have to watch any of it, right? Okay, anyway. Okay, so back to the chat. Oh, we're just gonna do it. Um, Cindy says, those pink and white clip-ons that you said were in rough shape, I love those questions. Okay. Um, <laughs> I was like, what? Hey, Forever Lose on Jill says, hey, Margaret, you interrupted my viewing of one of your earlier videos. Hey, Deborah. Sorry to interrupt. I wasn't planning on coming live today. I already put my video up, but I was like, I am in a good mood. I am letting it go. I am getting movers, packers. I'm hiring people to do stuff. Like I've got this light here that I need to get um, switched out. We really are going to unbox this, I swear. Um, but I just decided I am hiring somebody to do that. I am hiring somebody to like clean the the vent, the dryer vent, mine doesn't just go out the house, okay? Mine goes like up and out through the roof. So I, some smarty pants on the, like on the, on the neighborhood or the, our town's like Facebook, I was asking for recommendations of people and he was like, uh, just get a broom and cleaned out like the rest of us. I was like, oh, excuse me, but mine goes like not out the, the house, but like whoosh, out the ceiling. So no can do, mister, um, whatever. Somebody, I, I don't know that that was his actual tone, but, I'm just going to go ahead and give that to him. Uh, so <laughs> anyway, um, thanks, Debbie. <laughs> hello, hello, everybody. Um, extra. Yeah. You would watch. OK, you would watch that video. Nini says, um, just got my hair chopped and highlighted. Connie says, hey, hey, Donna. Oh, the chat jumps. I'm sure I'm missing people. Uh, oh, dear. I really did miss a lot in the chat. OK, going back, going back. Ah. Uh, Life happens, things get loud, definitely. Okay, new year, hi Susie, thanks for coming. I'm so glad you're here. I <laughs> know Dan, Mimi's a sweet girl though. Um, thanks so much, Cindy. Okay, let's see, hey Perla, hey Carissa. I wanna make sure, I, I'm sure I'm missing people and I apologize if I'm missing saying hi. Hey Brock, how's it going? And, 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 oh, da, 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 da. Uh, I jumped again. Okay, I'm moving on. Um, I know you have a, your stores on vacay, but didn't you used to do sales up to, oh yeah, I did. Like I used to do a sales update every single Monday. I, I would show if I had five sales or if I had 20 sales. Nick, oh my gosh, hey, oh, how are you feeling? Nick and Andrea and Zaheer and Rebecca just did the moonwalk, not the dance, the moonwalk, but they did, this uh, it's a marathon basically they walked 26.5 miles in the middle of the night uh for cancer right um but yeah yay hey hopefully you're okay uh do penelope snickerdoodle um what's her last name again I, forgot. I can't do it just on command i've got to find the piece right 
<laughs> Schnitzelwitzel. It's Penelope von Schnitzelwitzel with a Sue. Darling. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, I, I will definitely get my sales updates going again. Um, I don't do, I, do you mean like do I, no, I don't actually color adult coloring books, no. I can't sit still that long. I, I really can't. Um, okay, okay, I did, I did. Okay, feeling very sore overwhelmed, but lots of support, Nick says. Oh, good. Okay, so I'm going to try that where any piece that I find that is worth, like, that I'm planning on selling, I have my camera ready, so after the show, I'll take video clips, and then I'll edit it together, and it might take, you know, a day or so, but I'll put supplemental, blah -de -blah. Um Bye, Debbie. Okay, there. <clears throat> Lots of chit-chat to start with, but let me get a sip of water, and then, and then we'll dive in. Okay, so I hope you like the thumbnail, too, because I was like, you know what? You want me? You got me. Here I am. Silly faces and all. Okay, okay, here we go. <laughs> so, you know my rule, I always say this, um, is that I have to find something in the bag that will make my money back. And this one was iffy, so it was $24.99, and it was an iffy one. I see a rosary in there. That was one thing, and then there was a ring that had parrot on it. Where did it go? There was a ring. I think, yeah. Okay, there was a ring with a parrot. I can't find it now. But I'm going to show it to you, and I'm going to try to slow down, because you know I get going, and I start moving fast. There's some pretty green somethinging. Somethinging. Yeah, we're opening it. <laughs> Is that a cupcake? Oh, Diane, did you see my, if you follow me on Instagram, or I think I shared it on Facebook, too. I was hiding cupcake from the kids, but I had it in a solo cup. So they couldn't see me, and then it was in there. This is not a cupcake. Okay, now let's do this. If you haven't hit subscribe yet, go hit subscribe. And if you haven't joined Jewelry Lovers yet on Facebook, go join Jewelry Lovers and Sellers. Oh, and my ad, my admin buddies, um, that would be Cindy and Debbie and Mary and Christine and my sister and. Who else is admin in there? Anyway, you know who you are. Um, what do you think? Because jewelry lovers and sellers is quite a mouthful. And we always get people that are confused because then they try to sell jewelry in the group. If we just like smoosh the name and just make it jewelry lovers. But tell me what you think. I'll talk to you about it. Okay. All right. So here we go. I cut the bag open. And here we go. So first up, we have got a silver tone bangle. Where did my magnet go? Um, Nick says, I'm glad jewelry's your thing, because looking at that bag just gives me a headache. You picked through Lego. I mean, I like Lego too, but. Okay, so, so far, it doesn't appear to be magnetic. So, so far, not magnetic, but that does not mean it's silver. But you're up late, aren't you, Nick? It's like, what, 1.30? Holy moly. All right, so, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's just a silver tone bangle. It seems to be in pretty good shape, so I don't know. Hey, guys, are you all watching that? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Big money, no whammies, right? All right, so there's that. That's on the fence where I may be on that one. Next up, we've got this bangle, which will go either into a lot or go in my redonate pile. Um, so I'm going to put that down there. All right. Wait, what did I miss, Jan? What's 400 on? Whoa! Watching me from the hot tub. All right. Um, so enjoy. <laughs> Next. Here we go. We have got this necklace with these green and silvery toned colored beads. And... Hmm, I don't know. I, what do you think? Would you try to sell this? These are like stone, though. Those are some kind of stone in there. I don't know. Tell me what you think. Would you try to sell this? I mean, it's got this kind of like olive green color, which I don't see a ton of. I'll look it up and see. How about that? Because I don't, I don't see a whole, whole lot of things that that have that kind of dark, dark green. 
Um, I'm not driving wine, but I did have a glass of, or him having a glass of wine tonight. Does it make me drunk? Now, <laughs> I haven't, I have not had anything to drink in a month, probably since November. And I decided that all the stress I've been under warranted me having a glass of wine. And apologies if that is not something you want to watch. A lady look at jewelry, talk to her friends, and enjoy a glass of wine. I don't normally broadcast it, but since you asked, there we go. Okay. So next up, I have this. This will go into a lot. It is missing a stone, or not a stone. See, it's miss, not missing a stone. It's missing a sparkly light thing. That was just because it's me, not because I've had a wine. <laughs> All right, so Wendy says fireball. Is that what you're having? <laughs> yeah. Okay, next is this watch. And it is a guess watch. I'm missing something in the chat. Hang on. It's got this pink leather, yeah, genuine leather strap. There goes that. All right, get back on here, you. <laughs> I'm te I know, Julie, I know. This, this is how I'm such a lightweight. <laughs> but I figured, you know what? I'm in, under so much stress. I think I could have a glass and be okay. All right, so I don't know. I mean, I mean, it's guess. I don't know that it really... I mean, and then the leather is not in awesome shape. So this will probably go in our basket of watches for us to learn about. Okay. <laughs> Cindy says she's laughing that I'm drinking it out of a red solo cup. Cheers, y'all. <laughs> I need to have like, you know those redneck wine glasses? And they would have like a solo cup with a, a wine stem like hot glued to the base of it. Yeah. Well, I don't trust me not to break a glass. <laughs> Let's just be real. You see how clumsy I am? Um, so here we go. Um, those bangles will go over there in a lot. This is really cute. Okay. This is another Geneva watch, but I really like this. It's in really good shape. Let me rub that because it made it look like it wasn't. But look, the, the glass part is really in good shape. It's black with these lime green crystals. I love this watch. Like personally love it. I do. Okay. So this, I will try to sell. I know that Geneva is not a brand. I mean, that I can tell you. It's not like a hot selling brand. But I love the color combinations with the black and the green. And it's in perfect condition. Yeah, it just probably needs a battery. <laughs> Cindy says, I'm from Arkansas. We is hillbillies. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> okay. I deserve a whole box and another cupcake. I have more cupcakes in the fridge. We went yesterday afternoon. That's what I told Randy I wanted. I was like, just I want cake. I just want cake. And so then we went to the cupcake place in town and I got some to bring home. And then I shared that. And then somebody tried to cupcake shame me on Facebook and I wasn't having it. Um because I, I shared the whole like hiding the cupcake and, and somebody was like, why didn't you share with your children? How dare you? No, he didn't say that. But I was like, dude, these are my Mother's Day cupcakes. <laughs> I have to share everything. And, and they got ice cream at the Moody Gardens. So they're good. I didn't get ice cream at the Moody Gardens. No, I did not. Okay. All right. Next up, we have got this clear plastic bangle with lots of little sparkly sparkles in there. You know, I don't know. I don't know that this is really worth selling, but I'll look it up. I will look it up. Okay. Next, let's see if I can pull this out. That's cute. Okay. This has a K with little sparkly stones on a gold tone chain. You okay over there? Yeah, I think so. I don't see, y'all tell me if I'm going too fast showing stuff. It's kind of in rough shape on the back. Uh, see, so I mean, I probably won't try to sell it unless it's gold. No shame in your name, right? Thanks. 
All right, so there's that. I'm going to put that over there because I probably won't, won't try to sell that. Okay, next, we've got another little just bangle here. <laughs> I'm laughing in the chat. Okay, this looks promising. These look like they could be garnet chips, like a little garnet chip necklace. I'll have to look at them a little bit closer. But as you can see, they're that really dark, dark red. Okay, so I will look this up and let you know. <laughs> I'm looking, if you're watching this later, try to catch a video live because everybody's really nice in the chat and they're all talking. Um, let me know, Connie. Who are you looking for, Mikey? Okay, then we've got some earrings from, I don't know where, but no, no, leave Mimi alone. She's fine. <laughs> uh, it's got some little reindeer, it's got little bells. I probably won't try to sell those just because. I mean, they look cute, but maybe they'll go into a lot. Oh, hey, this looks cool. Ooh, this does look cool. All right. So far, we're like, well, I'm getting our money back, but this is pretty cool. All right. How, do, how does it sound? That's the question. Not too bad. I'm trying to decide if it sounds like, like a cow in a field. Maybe. <laughs> Does it sound like a cow in the field coming in because Farmer Brown's coming to round them up for the night? Maybe. Okay, I don't know. I digress. Anyway, <laughs> so here's this necklace with all of these discs. And, oh, dear. Okay, Connie, just message me, Facebook or TexasGalTreasures at gmail.com. It is loud, right? Like, if my cows were lost in the woods, I'd be able to find them. <laughs> so, it's, I don't know what to make of this. I mean, the enamel looks okay on these discs, I guess. Yeah. I mean, it's not scraped or chipped or anything. I'll try to sell it. It's pretty eclectic. And I won't mention the whole cow sound. Um, but look, I mean, it's really... Okay, you can't really hear the cow sound when you're wearing it. It doesn't do it. More cowbell. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, now it just looks like a bunch of circles. Like I couldn't decide what paint to use on my paint palette, so I just put my paint chips on there, and then if I'm like addicted to my lead paint chips, I can just eat them. Um, <laughs> anyway, I'll let you know what I find out about that. Oh, oh okay. Oh, it's Chico's. <laughs> Okay, so Chico's, so there are people that really like their Chico's jewelry, so I will let you know what I find out about that. Chico's. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, um, okay, next, <laughs> we have a little gold tone bangle. It's kind of twisty. Um, it, it will probably end up just in a lot, like so. Okay. And then we have a shower curtain ring. Because why wouldn't we? Hopefully that's the only one. I don't need a full set. Um, <laughs> thanks, guys. <laughs> All right, so next we have this. And I've sold necklaces similar to this. Um, or not necklaces, but bracelets. But this one is broken. It wouldn't be too hard to fix. But I don't know that it would be worth fixing. I don't know. I'll see. I'll decide. Uh, <laughs> Julie says it went from lost cows to eating lead paint in T minus three seconds. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's about right. Okay. Okay. Um, Jack cows. Yeah. Okay. Next. There goes that. Okay. These are some cute little earrings. Maybe I'll try to sell these. There's just silver, little silver tone, moon and stars. But I think they're cute enough that, that somebody would like those. I'll, I'll let you know. I saw a bracelet like that for $10 not broke. Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> I'm still alive, yes. Okay, oh. Um, 
Hang on. I'm going to grab that necklace for Connie that I threw in the pile. Hang on. Because I know it's just going to get buried. And if I don't grab it now, I will forget. Okay, let me, I'm grabbing it. Hang on. I'm really committed to this chair, apparently. My body does not want to evacuate the chair. There we go. Okay, I got it. I set it aside, Connie. Uh, oh. <sighs> okay. And I knew this necklace was going to need a little more attention. So, next we have got this necklace. Kids? Okay, I can't hear it. I hear them, but I can't hear them. Does that make sense? So this one, uh, gosh, is that, do I have it upside? No, nope, that's right. Okay, so I am working it out in my brain right now. So this necklace goes like, oh, like this. I mean, this is like, like a queen, like a, I don't know. This is, I think this will sell. I'm just trying to think of words. Like, I have no character for this necklace. Sorry, <laughs> but I, I, yeah, it's really cool. I could see somebody, pardon me, I hear like hollering and hopefully I mute the right thing. I don't know what they're doing. Okay, right, it looks like a centipede. Yeah, it's not heavy though at all. It's really lightweight. And it's, I don't even think it's metal. I think it's plastic. I think it's like a plastic, or if it's metal, it's real. No, it's metal. Okay. So, I, I don't even know. I don't know. Uh, flat gold. It's almost, I want to say tribal, Egyptian. I don't know. Like to me it to me it's like African almost, but not. You know what I mean? Like I don't know. I don't want to say the wrong words, but I, you know. <laughs> it's Joan Crawford necklace. Ooh, I'll have to look that up. Okay, next. But yeah, I'll let you know. I'll do a little research and find out. Egyptian, right? Tribal. Yeah. No, not wooden. Okay, so next up, we have got this. It is chain on leather. Chain on leather, right there. Ladies on so and soap operas in the 80s wore those. Now, oh, this is totally punk rock. I need a punk rock anthem to sing for you guys. Name it. Somebody know a punk rock song I can sing for you? If I know it, I'll sing it. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. What's a good punk song? Um, that doesn't have too many bad words. <laughs> I can't think of one right now. Nobody's helping me. Okay, so yeah. Ta-da! I don't know. <laughs> okay. I fought the law. Is that punk? Yeah, I guess it is. Breaking rocks in the hot sun. I fought the law and the law won. I fought the law and the law won. I needed money cause I had none. I fought the law and the law won. I fought the law and the law won. I met my baby little piece of baby and it felt just in time. She's the best friend I ever had. I fought the law and the No, it's not really punk rock. You don't think so? Kinda, a little bit, yeah. God Save the Queen, I could do that one too. I need to get in the right frame of mind for God save the queen, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Highway to Hell. That's what my ex-husband said our marriage, our, our, our marriage theme song should have been. <laughs> he wasn't wrong. Okay. Um, rock or chick more. Okay. There we go. Cher would wear that bracelet. Okay. Now, hang on. I've got things falling. Look, we don't need a full set. I already said that. I fought the laws in old rock. That's a that's a clash, yeah. That's the, I like the clash. Okay, I've got tangles here. I've got tangles. Ah. Uh, okay, I'm just trying to detangle. Here we've got another bangle. Multi talented. <laughs> 
Okay, tangles. I'm not prepared for tangles. All right, here we go. Royal wedding garb. There we go. Leathers and chains. There's a lot of leather and chains in here, I guess. Right? Okay. Next up. <laughs> I don't know. This is really interesting. I kind of like it. So this chain bracelet has got these little chains throughout, and then it's got a tassel on it. I do like that. I mean, that's got a little bit of extra pizzazz, right? In honor of the manic money, there we go. <laughs> uh, how does that one start? I can't. I don't. 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 I, I'm not prepared for that. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that to you. All right. So there we go. I'll let. I'll look that one up. That one's pretty cool. All right. All right. <laughs> Oh. Oh, do you not know the song God Save the Queen by the Sex Pistols? Oh, they're talking in the chat. Okay, we've got another bangle there. There we go. Six sick black already. I was just in the middle of a dream. There we go. <laughs> I was kissing Alice Cooper. No, I'm saying <laughs> Valentina Faya. Crystal, something, something, stream. All right, all right, all right, all right, focus. Do a Bengals mystery a lot. <laughs> yeah, I've got a lot of them. Okay, so this is a cool one. I like this. It's a really long silver tone chain necklace, but it's almost cosmic with these little um, sparkly balls, right, on them. And y'all, I just asked yesterday again about how what that's called. And someone told me again, and I promptly forgot again. So, <laughs> you know the word, yeah, there we go. You're singing crystal blue Italian stream. Look, 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 they're singing in the chat. Okay, good, good, good. Thanks, you guys. <laughs> All right, so that I will try to sell. I like that a lot. Um, I sold, okay, cool, cool. And Nick says I had a crush on Susanna Hobbs. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, here we go. Now, these are, um, this is like one of those fetish necklaces, if you know what I'm talking about. Normally, they're made with little stones and things. Only this is not a necklace. It's got all the little birds and fish and stuff, but it's an eyeglass. Like for your eyeglasses, I haven't seen one like this. So I am going to check this one out. Do we think it's silver? I mean, it's pretty tarnished. I don't know if it's silver or not, though. Let's see. Prince wrote just another manic money. You know what else Prince wrote? That is from one of my favorite artists. He wrote, nothing compares to you. And Sinead O'Connor is one of my, I have many favorite artists, apparently. But yeah, I, I went through a, a major Sinead O'Connor phase in the 80s. Boys. Stop wrestling. Somebody always gets hurt. Are your hands still on your brother? Okay. <laughs> anyway. Now, again, sorry. I have to parent and jewelry. You understand. You understand, I'm sure. Uh, I'm like, oh, my gosh. That is my song to my mom. Oh. Yeah, yeah, totally. My favorite one of Sinead O'Connor's is The Emperor's New Clothes. That's a good one. Um, yeah. So, what is this? What have we got here? Where? Oh, oh. We're working on it. Hang on, hang on. Wait, uh, not too long ago. They know you're having <laughs> one. Uh, they might know. Or they think I'm drinking a cupcake, one or the other. They're getting to stay up late and watch a, a video, so hey. All right, so this is a, okay, I'm going to be, <sighs> I like this necklace, okay? I'm trying to be critical, but the cords gross me out because they're kind of fuzzy. They don't look fresh and clean. But the beads are just amazing. I love these beads. This is one, look at this, look at this. 
Look at that bead. Isn't that gorgeous? And look at this orange one. Okay. I have a secret. I'm not telling you yet, but I'll tell you in a second because I can't keep secrets. Um, yeah, these beads are gorgeous. But here's my secret. My secret desire after we move um, is that I want to start taking silversmithing classes. So not that this necessarily has to do with these jewelry bits, but I really am wanting to take jewelry smithing classes and I'll show you my inspiration. They look like hard candy. Okay. Sorry. We're going to get off topic for a minute. There's a lady I follow who's a silversmith who's totally inspired me. Sorry. I'm going to have to just have to show you something on Instagram because I do. Um, where is she? Where is she? Here she is. Okay. Please let me still be winning. I may be winning. We'll see. Um, so she has made, she's a silversmith and she made this shark, this laser shark, laser shark, right? From the Lego movie. Right. And she's doing an auction right now. And I don't know. Oh no. Gosh. Oh, I'm outbid. Okay. never mind. I thought it was doing good. Totally got outbid. Anyway, anyway, whatever. Um, her, hers is Tess. Tessa Rand jewelry, but anyway, she's really inspiring. Take a look at this ring she she made. It's this like snake, and she gets these stones. There was another one. She shows her drawings, like she draws it out, and then shows how she's gonna create it, and then she makes it in silver. And I'm just like, dude, I want to do that. That's awesome. She makes amazing stuff. So it just drew. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna sit here and drool. Sorry. For a second, I'm trying to show, I'm finding another picture to show you. That's really what I'm doing. So like, here's another one she did with a snake and like a big old stone. Isn't that awesome? Carnelian. Okay. So stuff like that. It just, she blows me away. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So that, I'm really excited about this because I think in Austin, I, I, I'll find, you know, I hear that it's a really big makers community. So I have a feeling I'll be in good, a good place to learn silversmithing. So we'll see how that goes. I am also a mom and homeschooling and everything else. So it may just be something that eventually I get to do, but I, I'm really interested in learning to do it. So, okay. Hey, hey, I'm looking, um, put on your, do you ever remake hauls? I'm not sure exactly what you mean. Sorry, I'm detangling and reading. Um, there's a fire silver, oh, cool, cool. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, if you if you get a chance to go follow this lady on Instagram, she totally amazing. Something, yeah, jewel worthy stuff. And her stuff sells so she has an Etsy store, but a lot of her stuff sells so fast. Or she'll do custom pieces. She's got one that's like this um, amethyst. It looks like a little piece of cake or a pie. And then it's on a pl little plate and it says, eat me. And then on the top of the pie, instead of having like berries, it has little amethyst, uh, like a geo type amethyst. Totally nice. Totally. Totally. I'm saying totally a lot tonight. Okay. So next up we have this that is not broken yet. Oh, it is broken. Okay. So there's this beaded necklace that I spent a long time detangling. And it's just going to go in a lot because it's broken. There you go. Her name was, T I think it's Tessa Rand Jewelry. Yeah, Tessa Rand. Where's the cake? Hang on. I got to show you the cake now that I got it open. I got to reopen again. Right? You're here. You love me, right? Where's the cake? All right. Wait. Here. Oh, here's a blue one. There's a blue cake. But there's another one with the amethyst. Here we go. Look. Look. And then the crest is little pearl. Pearl crest. Isn't that amazing? It's amazing. Okay. Do I ever think that is an aspiration? I know myself and how in um impatient I am. So, okay. So here we've got just a pearly bead necklace that's going into a lot. And then community see, and that's the thing. My father-in-law, he's a blacksmith. He does blacksmithing classes like that community call. He does blacksmithing classes. He does silversmithing. Um, but he lives in California. So that's not going to help me any. 
And he, and when Randy told him, he's like, oh, I've got all this info I can send her. And Randy said, don't send her anything right now or her brain will explode. So I'm hoping, you know, he will, he'll have some in insight as well. So this is cool, only it's kind of gross. <laughs> and it's a glass, one of those, you know, the glasses chains. So this is, yeah, it's gonna go into a lot or to redonate. So, oh, oh thanks, yeah. Jewel oh yeah, I see jewelry makers everywhere in Texas, yard sales estates, so everywhere making their own jewelry. Oh, cool, cool, okay. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I am looking forward to it. Who knows? where it will take me or if I'll lose interest <laughs> or if I just won't have time. All right. So here we go. Tell me what you think about this one. I think it's hideous, but you might like it. I I don't like this, this right here. I don't, I don't know why. I think it looks like, okay. It looks like when you're wet and then you forgot you were wet and you were like putting on baby powder and it cakes all over you because that always happens because I don't ever put baby powder on me, but I can imagine that's what it would look like if I did. So it looks like somebody's backside with too much baby powder and they forgot to dry off after they got in the shower, they got out of the shower, they put on their baby powder and they've got baby powder caked all over their backside. Don't you agree? <laughs> I'm just like, what is she talking about? Do you like it? He's like, eh. <laughs> it's a necklace. I bet somebody would love it. Sure, you can see it. We haven't had any bonus here yet. So far, that's the junk jewelry. I tell you what, I'm going to reserve judgment and save it and look it up because maybe somebody will love it. This one, though, this one I like. Okay. Um, did I say dangly bit? Maybe I did. Okay. The sun speaks for the people, right? <laughs> um, all right, here we go. Ready? This one is awesome. It's orange, and it's got these graduated discs of shell beads. Somebody is going to just look at it. It's amazing, um, but I don't know at the moment what I would sell it for. And it's got a nice weight to it and it moves. It's very serpentine. Okay. <laughs> I'm laughing in the chat. Have you guys? <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, <laughs> if you aren't watching live, come check it out. So yeah, this is really cool. I will definitely sell this. It feels really, okay, you know when you find these and they just feel cheapy? This one feels really well made. It feels really nice. I don't know. Um, this one, honey. Let's see, you like it? You like it? Okay. He likes it. We're ready to screw this. Yeah. Okay. Now, carrot necklace. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Did you find some stuff? Oh, we've got another one. Somebody's shower. Okay, we're gonna have to have a talk with the people at the Goodwill and, and let them under, understand that this is not jewelry. That is a shower curtain. Is that called Bohemian? Possibly. Yeah, that's a shower curtain. It's like for hanging the shower curtains oh. in the shower. Will you really talk to Goodwill? No, I won't really talk to Goodwill about it. But we can pretend. We can pretend. We, yeah. I'm, I'm detangling again. Here we go. All right, so next up we have, you like that one? Okay. <laughs> We've got a ribbon with these kind of hematite colored stones. I don't think they're really hematite. They're just that gray color. And it's got more dangly bits for you, Dan. Okay, <laughs> in the chat. And these different shades of gray <laughs> colored chain. I think this will sell. I don't see a maker's mark or anything. That's what the clasp looks like. Um, we were talking about you earlier, Murphy Dieski. At the very beginning, nothing bad, nothing bad. Okay. So again, I will have to look this over and see. 
I'm looking to see if I see any missing stones. It looks pretty good though. Looks pretty good. There we go. I'll let you know. <sighs> okay, I'm missing something because I don't know what you're talking about in the chat a little bit. Um, okay. <laughs> All right. Go, oh, go hit the thumbs up. Let, <coughs> let me ask you to do that real quick. Let me see how many people we've got watching too. 41 thumbs up, one thumbs down. Oh, well, you can't please them all. Hi. Hmm? Yes, you may. Let me know if you need help. Okay. Okay. So next up, we've got some more bangles. And let me get the... There. Okay. So they're all magnetic. So right now, that's going over to the lot. Okay. Um, <laughs> um so, okay, okay. So next we've got, oh, do you know how I feel about this like wire, like fishing line stuff? It just makes a big mess and I don't like it. So that's going over there. What's up, sugar? Hey, Jay, oh, thank you, dear. Thank you. Okay, next. We're working on this. Okay, I see some promising things. They looked like they, they had that marcasite look to them. Oh yeah, <laughs> the my TARDIS phone booth wouldn't open. Did you get the um, milk for him? Was that okay? Okay. He might need to pull the tab out of them inside. That's what I did. Oh, did you? Okay, good. Okay, I'm detangling. Okay, I'm, I'm detangling. Uh. Okay. Ah, uh, turn it. Okay. I feel like I'm not talking to you, and I feel bad because I'm not talking. What I need to do is find the clasps and unclasp them because this looks cool. These all look kind of cool. Aha, uh -huh, that worked. Okay, so first up, this has got. Oh, this is sweet. Okay, we have got some little crosses with red. It's like just like a red enamel in there. And then a little, what I believe to be little Bibles. That's got the cross on one side and the fish on the other. And then the back of the crosses have this sort of Celtic look to them. Hang on, let me hold it up closer so you can see. It's really cute. Okay. Now, I don't think it's really silver. Nope. But I'm going to look it up because I think this is really sweet. Something fell in. Okay. All right. There we go. <laughs> Bum crack Pricker says, I just realized it was my birthday today. Well, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hang on. I'll pull that up. No, the Bibles don't open. I'll look at it again, though, just in case. Hang on. Some things fell out of the bag, and we can't have that. And I'm scooching down on my... Bum crack Picker... So are you an Aries? Do you follow that kind of stuff? Do you care? Or a Gemini? Is it Gemini right now? What is it? Um, I'm looking to see if the little Bible's open. No, nope, they don't open. They look like they would, though, but they don't. Okay, happy birthday if it is your birthday. Okay. Goodness gracious. Okay, fine, fine. I'll, I'll show you. So next, there is the parrot ring I was telling you I saw. So here is this. What do you think that is, a parrot or a macaw? Some sort of bird that eats nuts because of its beak. And it's one of those double ring ones. But I can't, who wears this? I can't get it on my fingers. How do you do, I guess you'd wear it like so. I've got a bird on my finger. Yep. Oh no, oh no, it's stuck. <clears throat> there we go. So cute, I'll look that up. 40 something, me too. My birthday's on Saturday, so we're almost birthday buddies. <laughs> almost. Here we go. Next are these earrings that are a lot of stuff. We have, a, there's two of them. I'm just going to show you one, though. So I think one is maybe all you can handle. It's got this little piece, it's got chains, and it's got giant stars. But, oh, 
Oh. These have like a whole character wrapped around them, don't they? Okay, here we go. <laughs> They're singing it. Um, I, I will let you know about that parrot ring, Mary. I'm going to set it to the side. These, okay. But now, I don't know if y'all remember Darlene. Darlene, um, Darlene, I think that was her name, but she she surfaced a while back when we were having the um, we were having that fight out in in the parking lot. We had to take our shoes off. Remember that one? I don't know if y'all remember. These look like some that Darlene would wear down the honky tonk. Hold my shoes. Hold my shoes, Mary Ellen. I'm I'm going outside. She looked at my man. Now she looked at my man. I know he's wearing the ropers, but that doesn't give her any uh, excuse to look at it okay all right i need another i need another piece of big rig big rig big red big red <laughs> what's that gum the red gum what was the red gum called big red it was big red right anyway whatever she's chewing her cinnamon big red gum okay hold my earrings these are now i can't i don't want to mess these ones up i just got them <laughs> no I went, I went into town to get them. I did. I went in, I went into town and got them at the ice in. <laughs> okay. So next up is this bangle. This is going in a lot over there. Um, the honky tonk, y'all. Yeah, that's my honky tonk earrings. I couldn't wear those to work. What would you know? What my boss would say? Yep. Well, I mean. <laughs> I am working on being a hygienist right now. I'm just working reception at the at the dentist office. But once I get done with my night classes down at the community college, I might just be able to become a hygienist. So I just love teeth. <laughs> I don't have the earrings on. Can I still do the act? Can I, still? I don't know what it is about teeth. I just love them. And when I see a man in a nice pair of ropers, a nice pair of wranglers. He's got his Wranglers, he's got his Ropers, and he's got a nice set of teeth on him. I just can't help myself. Now, can I? What would... I'm trying to detangle it, honey. Can I help? You can. You can look at it, yeah. Oh, can I help? Oh, okay. Can James is going to untangle that one. <laughs> he's got his eye on it. Okay. Come for the Wranglers. Come for the Ropers. Stay for the Wranglers. Anyway. Um... You can always teach, go back and teach in line dancing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is broken. Maybe, no, it's not. Okay, that needs to be clipped off. But I think I'm just having too much fun by myself. I need to sit, I need to sit up a little bit. <laughs> okay, this one has got, look, little whales. Aren't they sweet? Little wooden whales. Um, I'm trying to decide if I would sell this. I think I could. What would have to happen is this piece right here, part of the necklace is the wire is coming out. And I would have to, you know, because gosh, that's a pain. You'd have to string that in there through that. I'll see if I can fix it. I'll let you know. I will let you know. Um, well, much lady said my sister's name was Darlene. Uh, Darlene, 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 Darlene. Is that correct? Yes, that is. Okay. Okay, so here we've got this necklace. It's got this little mother of pearl disc. And then underneath, what stone would you say that is, James? Uh, it looks like a, a pyrite. It looks kind of like a pyrite, doesn't it? It was silvery pyrite. Good job. You get an A plus for science today. <laughs> can I have a prize for anything like that? Can you get a prize for anything? You can have all my junk jewelry. What? All right, so I will have to look into this one because it is unusual. Um, Laverne. Oh, my gosh. Laverne was my grandmother's middle name, Laverne. And she would not forever tell me what her middle name was because she hated it. Okay. <laughs> Always go. Yep, yep. Okay. Margaret's boys are like that TV show where you never saw the neighbor's face. Oh, that was um, Home Improvement, right? Where Dan would, he, no, it's not, Tim would talk to his neighbor over the fence, right? And then like the last episode, they was, they showed his face, yeah. Jolene, yeah, that's the song, not Darlene. Sorry, Heather. 
Okay. <laughs> um, next up, we have got this necklace, which is, eh, I don't know. Tell me what you think. I this this part is the the beads are fine. They look like they're in okay shape. But then this looks maybe we'll get it closer. Eh, I don't know. Just <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I'll have to look at this one again. I'm not loving it. Mm, I don't know. I can't connect with it, I guess. Cape Cotton and take it vacation. Okay. What are you doing? Okay, okay. All right, next up we've got what looks like a silver, just necklace. Let me see if it's silver, silver. <laughs> oh yeah, okay, hang on. Let me set this down because it doesn't want to pull. I'm trying to see if it's silver or if it's just, so this might be silver. I don't know what they're doing over there. It says 925, and then it looks like it says Milor, M-I-L-O-R, Milor, I don't know. Okay, let me look at the other side. That says Italy. Okay, so what I'll do with this is I'll hang on to it for a pendant, like if I find a pendant without a necklace. Y'all, if I'm making a total fool of myself tonight, I don't even care. So I'm having fun. Um, I missed something, Heather. Ooh. Okay. Next, we have a gold tone necklace that was a dollar. Let's get the magnet just in case. And it is magnetic, so that'll go in a lot over there. Milor, okay, Milor, Italy is sterling, good find, yay, thank you. Okay, then we've got the rosary, and I've just been saving the rosaries that I find lately. I, I don't know. Um, maybe it's the Catholic in remission that, <laughs> that is me that won't let me get rid of the rosaries I find. I just kind of like hoard them. Uh, so maybe, I don't know, I'll figure out what to do with them. I just can't quite, um, yeah, I don't know. I can't, I, I don't know. I just hang on to all the, the rosaries I find. <sighs> what? Okay. Gold snuff. Are you watching Antiques Roadshow and me at the same time? I, I love Antiques Roadshow. Don't we, guys? <laughs> They're going through the junk jewelry on the floor. All right. Next. All right, next up, we have a necklace that is silver tone. And then it's kind of got this, uh, what kind of animal print would you say that is? Like leopard? Some sort of, what do you think? What kind of animal print is that? Cheetah, leopard? Some sort of feline. Interesting. I don't see any kind of maker's mark on it. It's, I mean, it, it seems to be in good shape. So I will try to sell it and I will let you know. Leopard, yeah, yeah. Okay, there we go, like so. Oh, nice, I, I like selling Bibles, definitely. I did get rid of pretty much all the ones I had though before the move. I sold them in the garage sale or gave them away. Looks more like tortoise shell. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's another one. Um, Donna, oh, fading fast, no. Okay, I will, Donna. So here we have a, oh, that is something holding on there. I'm waiting for some more. You're waiting, <laughs> you're waiting for more. Some he likes to hold on to my, okay, then there's another earring hooked on that. Okay. The, okay, tell me what you think about this one, you guys. We're going to go for it. This one goes like so. I mean, this is a commitment piece. This one, I think tortoiseshell more. I guess it kind of looks tortoiseshelly. Yeah. I mean, this one is like, 
it's this one's this one's saying hello to the girls all right <laughs> so um I will definitely try to sell this because I can see how somebody would like that, but it's definitely going into places that need further explanation. But we have little it here. <laughs> anyway, you want to know it's not going into the junk lot because it will sell. It will sell, honey. I'm trying to get the yolks. Okay. <laughs> All right, next we've got some just little white beads. It is broken. So it's going in the junk lot. Yay. Okay. <laughs> hey, everybody. Okay. Oh, I mean, we've got another one. There we go. That's going over there. Okay. I'm still digging. We're still doing great. We've got this much left. Um, Dramatic pieces like that look like prom jewelry. There we go. I want to buy another jewelry jewelry. You want to buy another jewelry jar? I never bought one of those. Just buy yourself. Michael, what are you throwing around in there, sweetie? I throw this magnet on there so it like sticks. Okay, let's not do that in this second. Let's try that. Last time I did it worked. <laughs> All right, next up we've got this bead necklace. It's wire wrapped. It's got some other wire wrapped beads. The only problem, I really like it, is that it's a broken. So it is broken. Unless the rest of it is in there, you can see there's no clasp. A lot of the chain is missing. So unless it is an, no, I, don't know, I guess it could be an over the head one. If I fixed it like so, it could be an over the head one. And I have a big head, so that would work. James is like, what, darn it. Uh, so we'll see. I'll see what I can do with this one. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Okay. How we doing? How we doing in the chat, you guys? All right. Go over there. Hit the thumbs up, friends. Let's see. Oh, yeah. D he enjoys picking through the the junk jewelry or things I might redonate. And he, he's made a really nice little pile of cash, huh, bud? Yes, he has. He made a lot of money from the garage sale. A lot. <laughs> okay, so next up we've got this. Looks like it's missing some stones. So this one, oh, good night. We'll go in the junk lot. This as well, we've got another bangle. Then, hmm. I don't know what the, okay, this is very, I, I guess this looks like a Claire's piece, right? So it's a heart. It's got some swirly pink rhinestones. I probably won't sell this, so I'm going to hand this to my son. He's just waiting, waiting for it right now. He's like, just go ahead, Thank Mom. You. Hand it over. Thank you. You're welcome. James, what's your favorite song that I sing? Um, I don't really know. You don't really know. Okay. Do I embarrass you when I sing? No. No? Okay, good. Hey, Michael, please stop throwing that. Okay, next up, we've got a K necklace on a black cord. The cord is kind of funky. You know, it's kind of like all bent up. Um, but I want to say that, I mean, the K seems like it could be silver. Or I'm dreaming. Mr. Krabs. Mr. Krabs, K's for crab. Crusty crab. crab. Okay, so I'll find out about that. You need that. I'm gonna say I'll set it to the side. Let me know. Okay, then next looks. Oh, this jar's got some unusual pieces. So let's take a look. How would we describe this? <laughs> we have got, let's start up here. We've got a gold tone chain with some pink beads. They are both pearly and glassy. Then we've got some shell and some other pink stone beads, which are cool. And then we've got pink, what is that? Are they? Are they glass? I don't even. Glass. 
plastic. They're not plastic. They're too clicky for plastic, I think. Thing. This is. It looks like fish bones. <laughs> right? It's um. Hmm. This is one that's gonna take some some thinking, but it's pink, so I it will. Like it. Yeah, somebody will like it a lot because it is pink. All right, yeah, bum crack picker's birthday and pieces birthday. Happy birthday, you guys! So yeah, I will definitely look this up because one, it's unusual and it's pink. More belly dancer. Okay. Um, okay, so let's keep going. I see some cloisonne. All right, so next up we've got this cloisonne bead net and bracelet. The cord is grody, but I love the cloisonne. It never sells for what I think it will. I always say that, but I'm going to give this to my son because he's like, oh, my gosh, I love it. There you go. Enjoy, my darling. It's not grody. It's not grody? Okay, good. I just basically wanted for the boobs. Let you know, okay, Joe. I'm gonna set it inside. If you guys are see something, let me know. Just send me a message because I will forget. Um, but I'm setting it to the side. So send me a message either on Facebook or email TexasGalTreasures at gmail.com. Okay, next up are these earrings. I'll show you one. I have both, and they're very colorful. They're really like a boho type. Look at them, huh? They're fun. They're not me, but they're fun. Colorful, but also, yeah. <laughs> there we go. Very cool. You like all the colors? Yeah, they're showy. They're like, hey, look at my earrings. Are you looking at my earrings? I saw you looking. I saw you looking. Uh, not yet. So far, we've had one ring, that parent one. All right, there's another bracelet. I have it. I'm going to look it up. I know. I know. Can I see it? You want to see it? They look like gumballs, right? Okay, so those are going down there. Where's the parent? Hang on. Jane, can you see? Oh, wait. Some, I set it aside because somebody was interested. Mary, right? Can you see it over there? I could have sworn I set it aside. For me. Sorry, guys. Hang on. Oh, it is. Okay, don't walk off with it because I think Mary's interested in it. Who's Mary? Who isn't Mary? That's the question. Is it Mary Jane? <laughs> no, not Mary Jane. Okay, so next up we've got this bangle, and it is, you know, the coating is rubbing off, so it's going over into the lot. Oh, that's cool. Was it Mary? No, it wasn't Mary. Was it Mary? Somebody was interested in the ring. Anyway, it was me. It was you. Oh. Okay, step, step back. Everything I pull out, he's like, oh. <gasps> and this one is definitely worth that because it is pretty cool. This has got this cabochon. It's plastic, but all these different colors on this blue. It's kind of like velvety. Can y'all stop at the day and like the the sound of the metal? And then it has a magnetic closure. Let me get it. If I can get it. It's kind of a hard mat. There we go. Ta-da! Like so. What do you think? Cool, right? And there. Okay. Somebody was interested in the ring. Now I'm like, was it Mary? Okay, I think it was. All right, so I will look this up. I will figure this out. And then next we have UNT 2016, which I think is University of North Texas. I'll look that up as well. This is gross feeling. It's really sticky and yucky. What was the blue fabric? It feels like a velvety kind of, or maybe a jersey. It's really soft, though. Yeah, this is gross. Whatever it is, it's sticky gross. Yeah. And I feel like I need to wash my hands now. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, let me pull some bits up here. Uh, okay. 
Come on. I, I mean, it, the jar, the bag was $24.99. I was kind of like, meh about it. But oh, I think we're going to be okay. I think we found, found some funky, cool pieces. All right, we've got this. It's got roses. And this, cool. How does that open? How does that open? I thought it was a magnet. Oh, it, it snaps. Okay, it's a little snappy open, like so. Pop! Okay, so that I won't try to sell. I'm going to put that down there with the junk jewelry. We've got another bangle like so that I probably also won't sell. A Thanks. A bangle is like a bracelet that's like a hard bracelet that you slide on. So, yeah, that's a bangle. A bangle bracelet. Then... I know, I need the baby wipes. Maybe when I move, I'll get it together. Okay, now, hang on, let me pull these things apart for you guys. We have, I'm trying to detangle it a bit. Okay, we've got these red-ish, I don't know, they're kind of like a rusty red. What kind of red would you say that is? It's kind of like an orangey red, or rusty red. Um, oh, okay, okay, good, thank you, Susie. Yeah, so I'll look this up. I mean, this is, a, again, one of those that I'm just like, eh, I'm not crazy about it, but it might sell. Okay, take those and go do that over there. How about that? No, 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 you can totally do it, but just do it over, over there where it's not going to make background noise too bad. Oh, okay, okay, You're, it's all good, either way. Okay, next... I think we, I think I'll make the money back. Yeah, I mean it's not anything that's so far. There hasn't been anything like what gold, silver. Yeah. Again, I don't I don't like things that have the white like this fishing type wire stuff. So I don't like that. That's going over there. And then oh, this is a little bracelet. This is sweet. I like this. This little black lacy bracelet with it just it's not a bell i don't think no it's not a bell it's just like a little bead hang on one second one second guys. okay okay the bag was $24.99. All right, so here's this one. I'm going to look it up. It's got this kind of closure on it. Um, I don't know. I like it. I like it's kind of delicate. You know what I mean? Like so. Um, well, I, I, my sizer's in my other room, but I, do, I did keep the sizer out and all my jewelry stuff out because I'm planning on getting things going again once I move. All right, so next up, we've got this bracelet. It's got all these little chips in it, but they look maybe like some little carnelian chips and some little, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, but it's broken, so either I can fix it or, I mean, it'd probably be pretty easy to fix, like so. Cute. I don't know that it would be worth a ton, but I'll look it up. <laughs> hey, hey. And then we've got a little cross with black and white beads. Ah, uh, I don't know. Would you try to sell this one? Tell me what you think. Would you try to sell that one? Uh, like so. <laughs> you like my little intern just off camera? Yeah. Hang on. I'm scooching. I feel like I keep scooching down in my chair. And so I'm trying to pull my legs up under me so I can uh, get up higher. Hang on. One, two, three. Push. There. Okay. Got to sit upright. Okay. Okay. Hey, hey, I feel like I'm missing the chat. I kind of got sucked into the beads. All right, here we go. So I have a little bit left to go. We're doing okay. And I've got a few things up here that I need to show you. I was waiting for mates on. Oh, thank you. We you also bring the cats up? That might be helpful. Thank you, guys. It's feeding the cats. Uh, we've got a broken necklace, so it's a gold tone necklace, and it looks like that, and it's broken, I think. Yeah. 
I can't imagine it was supposed to look like that. So there we go. There's that. My phone just buzzed at me. Okay. All right. Mm, okay, so I'll look at that. Oh yeah, harvest the beads for sure, for sure. All right, another one of those. If I was doing beading and things like that, um, then I would do that, yeah. Here we've got a little plastic ring. It's, does it say diesel on it? Can you read that? What does that say? Ooh, it's rubbery. What does that say? It's, oh, it says Del Sol. All right, Del Sol ring. Just for you, my darling. Yes, you may. <laughs> Did you put the bags and necklace in the junk drawer? Uh, not yet. I have. It's not. It's broken. So I was gonna look at it. I was gonna look it over. You wanna look at it? You can look at it. Okay. Um. All right. Cool. Yeah. The kid in the last video. Yeah, Laurel. Those Laurel Birch button covers. And I could only find one other person selling those Laurel Birch button covers, and they were already sold. I haven't looked at that yet. So give me a second on that one. Okay, so next up we've got these, which I will try to sell. Look at that thumb. Mm -mm. Gross. Okay, so I will find out about these ones. I like the bright colors on them for sure. The gold and the orange. Ah, I see, cool. There's that, that's going over there. Oh, you, <laughs> Nini says I like the pink flower one that snapped on. Yeah, I well, my son has it, so he'll probably sell it. <laughs> okay, I found a bracelet I like. Come on, come on. And of course, it's hooked onto nothing more than fishing wire. Get off. Get off. Why do you have to do this to everything? You ruin everything. There, okay. <sighs> okay, let's just take a peek at this. We have got these shiny, shiny gray beads. They're very heavy. And then let's look at the clasp. There's the clasp. Ready for it? So it's gonna go in. Uh, here we go. It's gonna go in like that. And then it's gonna go in like that. Ta-da! I love it. They're knotted in between two, which is really cool. So I, I'm gonna have to figure this one out because I really like this. I mean, it feels really heavy, really substantial. The clasp is something special. And I don't know, it almost feels like it should have a maker's mark, but I don't think it does. Nothing over there, nothing over there. Nothing, 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 nothing over there. They're not pearls, they're, they have a metallic feeling to them. They're super heavy and super shiny. Ta-ta! Yeah. Right, yeah, well, here. Are you gonna hear that? Yeah. You think they're Tahitian pearls, but I don't think they're pearls at all. They're, they're not pearls. See? Da -da -da! Yeah, like maybe hematite or something like that, I think. But they're very cool. Oh, they're, it's kind of big too, though. Look at that, I just slid it right on. I could put that on my ankle. That's too big for a bracelet for me. Hmm, I wonder if it's a doll necklace. Let me know, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so it's awfully big, yeah. Ah! Beads went flying, son of a gun. Okay, next, what do we have up here? Okay, we've got some little rings. Oh, you know it. You knew it was coming. You just didn't know when. But now is when. We have the bonus hair. What if I were to like start collecting all the bonus hair and like putting it in the jar? And then I sell the jar of all the bonus hair. That's pretty weird. Okay, that would be gross. Okay, never mind that. Okay, so we've got a little ring. It's, it looks like a charm ring. I know, gross. <laughs> you never know. I'm kidding. It's a buck 85, it says, for this ring. Then there's another one just like it. 
So let's see, what does it say on the little tag? I cannot read what it says, but I'm going to check it. Nothing, nothing. Does it mean it's silver? But I'm gonna look at it closer. It says dime. And then, I don't know. What do you think, James? I see. Yep, you may see. There we go. <laughs> it would be really good to sell the bonus here. I agree. I agree. I, I was joking. I was joking. So where did you see the dime at? Uh, on the tag. It said dime on the tag. All right, next there is this watch, which is really gross and bad shape on the straps. Um, but we're going to hang on to it for now. It's got some sort of sensor or light or something in there. So we'll hang on to it for right now, and then when we're doing going through watches and stuff, we'll we'll mess with it. It is in the gym drawer. Mm -hmm. That is okay. Yes. Thank you. He says, "Who knows what we'll sell?" I heard a guy sell his air guitar for five dollars and fifty cents. I like his style. <laughs> Okay, next, there is a little, looks like a toe ring. Toe ring. Ah. We've got a rock, a little green rock. We have more in here. It's it's just more, I, I see more wiry stuff, and y'all know how I feel about that. Don't like it. Um, uh, I like these colors. Maybe I can extricate this from the rest because I like the blues and the greens. People are. I'm, I'm reading in the chat. Okay. Oh, gosh. Who, who was like, this is a good idea. Let's make jewelry with this wiry stuff that nobody, one, it doesn't hold its shape. Two, it gets tangled with everything. Those have some pretty red beads, though. And three... Just no. Um, did I tell about the cool squishy ball you can use to open watches? No, that sounds cool. Uh, am I doing Nick's game on Wednesday? I don't know. I don't. I don't think so. I don't know. I'll have to ask him. <laughs> he would know better than me. <laughs> All right, this is pretty. I like the colors here. I remember him talking, I know they were talking about it, but I don't know, I don't know. I have been out of touch with my friends in a bad way, so we'll just put it that way. We have a chat, we have a, a chat, you know, like where we chat during the day, and I've been woefully absent because of things. So this is really pretty, I like all the blues and the greens, I will definitely try to sell this. Okay, I will hold it up for you guys. Right there. Ta da! Yeah, I'll ask him. I know we're doing merch talk tomorrow. Um, and the kids and I are, might be doing something Wednesday, so we'll see. Because I'm trying to escape the house. Always. Okay. Okay. More tangles. You're waiting for more treasures. Did you guys gather all the cats? Okay, bust out the party mix. Okay, don't give her any more party mix. No more party mix. Oh, oh, come on. This is really tangled. Um, I, I know, and I feel really bad, because then I'll jump in, I'm like, guys, I'm stressed out. And I don't want to be that friend, you know, that's like only popping in when, like, I need you guys. Okay, bye. You know, and I don't want to be that way, so I just kind of go vacant for a while. I think they understand, though. I hope they understand. They know I love them. They know it. I try to jump into their chats when I can on their videos. Ah, ah, I am trying to get this apart. Okay, I am going to take this like so. Okay, now. Okay, here we go. Okay, there's one. Oh, please be Kendra Scott, but I don't think you are. 
Never mind. Okay, so this has got like a little geodey look to it, like so, on a gold tone chain. That's the back, and that's the front. And if you were looking for things that might be Kendra Scott, she likes to like sign along the edges. So I was looking along the edge, but I don't see anything. I'll still try to sell it. I mean, it's, I mean, it's nothing super flashy, but it's nice. Yeah. <clears throat> and I really want to do this because I'm trying to figure out if this goes on your foot or if this goes on your hand. I'm going to open this. I'm going to get it off. There. I did it. Yay. Okay. 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 Is this one of those? Let's see if I can figure it out. We had one in the other. Does this go on a foot or does this go on your hand? Right? It might be. I think this is a foot one. Right? Where you put this. I don't know. I think this must go on your ankle, and then this goes down to your toe. And I'm putting it on my hand. This was on someone's toe. Yuck. Okay, cool foot thing that I put on my toe, on my hand, maybe. Ta-da! Yeah, now I gotta wash all the way up to here. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's cool. I don't know what to call it. I know yesterday we had the ones that were called like slave bracelets where it's like a bracelet here and then there's like the chains and it goes down to the ring and it's kind of like that. Please. Oh my gosh. What if I just got like foot locker on my hands? I know it's not called foot locker, but like I, where I need to get Lotrimin all over my hands. Now I'm nervous. Um, <laughs> okay. I did it to myself. It's fine. It's fine. I'll be okay. All right. I'm putting things up here that I'm looking for mates. Ooh. Aw. Broken. Athlete's foot. That's what I'm thinking of. Can you get athlete's foot of the hand? <laughs> I know, right? I will. I will. I will. Okay. Next, we have a guest watch. I'll have to look it up. It looks in really good shape, too. I mean, it looks like it's just never been worn. It's really nice. Okay. I'll find out. Um, Let's... There's random little beads in here. There's more stuff. You know how it is. Sometimes the best stuff's at the bottom. That's what she said. Anyway, um, <laughs> I don't even know what that meant. So, okay, I'm still pulling things out. Hang on. And there are a few things that don't have mates. Like this is a really cool earring, but there's no mate for it. And little, little bits in here. I'm still looking. Hang on. And I have some stuff up on top that I'm going to show you. I'm digging. Hang on. I am digging for you. Ah, oh, darn. This one's cool, but there's no mate for it either, is there? Nope, 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 nope. Ah, okay. There's no mate for that one. This is a sweet little bracelet. I like the little curly swirlies on it. That's pretty cute. I'll try to sell that. And I'll come back and do a follow-up with the things that I say that I will try to sell and uh, let you know. So these ones feel like just like little tins. I probably won't. This is another one that I really wish the mate was there, but it's not. It's so cool. and I think where's my loop where did they go i think it's got a, a name brand in there so ah, let me see hang on yeah that's a trifari but there's only one curses okay what else what else we have one sea star earring unfortunately ah there's lots of one like one of this oh wait was that no 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 Nope. Okay. Okay, cats. Then we've got this bracelet, which again, I probably won't sell. It's cute. Maybe. Tell me what you think. There's that. Hmm. Hang on. This has got some kind of little mark in there. Yeah, the bracelet had like an eye in it. That other one? It did. It had a little eye. I am not listing right now. You do craft lots with your single earrings. That's a good idea. 
Maybe once I move, that might be something. This is another one. I wish the mate was there, but there's not. It looks like a branch or a piece of coral, like so. But the mate's not there. Oh, okay, I may start doing that then. Um, piece of saying you can get good money for single lot earrings. I will look into that. Thank you. Okay, my cat's going to go nuts now because we, we put the cats to bed at night because with four cats, if you don't, you're going to be up all night. One cat or the other is going to be after you. Okay, okay. So we've got that. another one, no mates, just a bead. I'm trying to pick up the pace because the cat's like mad now. And then we've got a leather strap like so. Do, 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 do. And I think, oh wait, we've got, hang on. There's like a little gold backing. Wouldn't that be nice if that was like a gold piece of gold? Just stuck down there in the bottom waiting for me. All right, let's look. I'm going in. Mm. Nope. Okay. All right, so that is the jar. Pancake's going to go over there and cry. Um, so, yeah, let me know. I'm going to do a follow-up with the pieces that I'm planning on selling. I'm going to take, you know, video footage and then just create a separate video. So if you're interested in checking it out, it might be, it might take me a couple days to get it up and out and all that stuff. Um, but I will do that. So let me know what you think about that idea because then, you, you know, you get the best of both worlds. And I do want to help people that are interested in finding out what things are worth and how to describe different pieces of jewelry. So definitely go over there and hit the thumbs up. And if you are not already, please subscribe. I would love to have you um, join our tribe because um, everybody's amazing. As you can see, if you're watching this later, check out the chat and see how friendly and wonderful everybody is. And just come and say, hey, I'm new. And everyone will welcome you straight into the tribe and make you feel quite, quite at home. Also, same thing with a jewelry group on Facebook, Jewelry Lovers and Sellers, totally free. Come join. Everybody's super friendly. If you've got beginner questions, ask them because we are definitely there to help. And once I get moved, we'll start doing more tutorials and themes again about, because I was doing themes every single month, you know, so we would learn new stuff. But right now it's just, let's deal with this. So yeah, go over there, leave me a comment if you're watching later, all the different things I'm asking you to do, a million different things, come on, Margaret. Just, that's a lot to ask of somebody. But just say hey, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. And oh, speaking of tomorrow, why don't we sing tomorrow? Oh no, you know what? When I ask Alexa to play anything off the Annie soundtrack, they're play, it plays off the new Annie soundtrack, which is not what I want. So I'm gonna play something else. What should we, I know, we're gonna play Michael's new favorite song right now. We're gonna say, hey Alexa, play, that's my paw by Sheb Wooley. I can't find that's my paw by Sheb Wooley. Oh. Alexa. Alexa, play that's my paw. Oh, I don't know. It's called that's my paw. Okay, okay. Well, now, dude. <laughs> okay, she's going to tear me up. Okay. Play that's my paw by Sheb Wooley. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, you did it. Good night, everybody.